nothing ventured, nothing gained, they say. And so it was for 30-year-old Omar Mohamed Shalo who tried his hand in employment in the air services sector in Dubai and failed. And at just 20 years of age, he was ready to give up. He, however, found the resolve to try his hand at something else, fashion. Katians Francis Ontomo recently attended a ceremony to mark the official opening of yet another new fashion outlet in the young man's fashion empire. And first, this story from Mombasa. Take a look. Omar Mahmoud Shalo left Kenya for Dubai in 2003 with a mission to set up base in the Middle East country. He landed a job at Dubai International Airport as a service executive. It was a job that really wasn't in his heart and before long he quit and life took a turn for the worse. The pressure to deliver was just too much. It did not take long however before he started crafting a major comeback to his homeland Mombasa. Four years later, he landed in Dubai. He came back intent on piloting a fashion line from the Middle East country. He began a fashion shop dubbed Limitless Reloaded and almost immediately captured the hearts of his mostly female clientele. Everybody that I used to deal with always used to think of Dubai as Dubai and Africa as Africa. And I always used to ask myself, why don't I bring uh, Dubai to Africa? Today, his business or empire, as he calls it, has expanded exponentially. He has two branches in Mombasa town, one in Westlands, Nairobi, and today opens the door to his newest branch, stationed in Nyali, Mombasa. Here he's targeting well-to-do clientele. I always like to bring things which people are always going to appreciate, because I do believe in word of mouth. As much as I do any advertisement in the world, but if somebody is satisfied with the product, then that's going to be the best way to market myself. Building the fashion empire has not been an easy ride. On several occasions, his business nearly folded due to several challenges such as lack of adequate capital. But Anina Sinaji pushed him to persevere. I think I've always had art in myself and I've always enjoyed uh, creating something which people go, wow. Research helped him to study the market trends and cut a niche for himself. And in no time he had saved some 6 million shillings which he pumped in to open this new station. He gets his talk from Dubai and Turkey. Right now I think the best way out is uh, to tap into the, the talent and uh, exposure and experience that others have already been able to do. Hii ni changamoto kwa vijana wengine ambao wamebaki majumbani ambao wao wanategemea kuajiriwa. Na kwa sasa tunaona serikali haina uwezo wa kuajiri wa Kenya wote ama vijana wote kwa jumla. During the colorful launch of the outlet the local leadership came to share in his success and encourage more youths to take up new business challenges. His dream is to expand the business empire and at the same time assist more youths to get into business. Francis Otomwa, KTN News, Mombasa.